A long, long time ago, there lived four great and powerful tribes. They were the elemental tribes of ice, water, fire, and earth. They lived for years as one, working together and doing their part for peace. But even the brightest of lights has to go out. There was darkness lurking in the shadows, waiting for the right moment to strike and steal the tribe's peace. The Shadows tribe, a tribe that harvested the power of shadows. Their ruler was wicked and wanted nothing more than to take away the other's power and peace. So the Shadow tribe went to the other four tribe leaders and demanded full control over their world. As soon as the tribe leaders heard his demands, they struck him down, knowing that he would not have mercy. Seeing this, the Shadow ruler pledged war, forcing the four tribes to fight the Shadow tribe. But just like all battles, this one ended in a broken bond. After the four tribes struck down the Shadow Tribe and cursed them to forever live in the Shadow Realm, they became distant. All of the leaders wanted something different, and not one wanted peace anymore. The events of the war brought even more war. The tribes who were once a great and peaceful tribe were now scared and warring. But yet there is always light in the shadows. A year after the Great War of Shadows, a prophecy was told that could end the four tribes' conflict. The prophecy said that soon the Shadow Tribe will rise again, and one of each elemental tribe will have to come together and bring back the peace that was lost so long ago. That they will defeat the darkness and bring back the light. They will unite the four tribes, and finally end the war that's been going on for too long. But how could four people, four kids, defeat the growing power of the Shadow's tribe? How can four kids put aside their differences and fight as one?